In this video, we're going to break down DNS, or Domain Name System, which is one of the most important protocols on the internet, yet often one of the least understood. Simply put, DNS acts like the address book of the internet. When you type a website address into your browser, such as google.com, your browser doesn't actually know where to go. It needs an IP address to reach the website, which is where DNS comes in. DNS translates human-readable domain names into machine-readable IP addresses. Imagine you're trying to send a letter to a friend, but instead of a name and address, you only have a phone number. DNS essentially works like the phone book, matching a website's name to the correct IP address. Let's look at how DNS resolution works in practice. When you enter a domain name into your browser, the following steps occur. 1. The browser checks local cache. First, your computer checks if the domain's IP address is already stored locally. 2. Query to DNS resolver. If not found, the request is sent to a DNS resolver. This is typically provided by your internet service provider, ISP. 3. Recursive query. If the resolver doesn't have the information, it will perform a recursive search, starting with the root DNS servers. 4. TLD servers. Next, the request is passed to the top-level domain, TLD DNS servers, like .com or .org, which point to the authoritative name servers. 5. Authoritative name server. Finally, the authoritative DNS server for that domain returns the IP address to your DNS resolver, which then sends it to your browser. Your browser can now connect to the website via the IP address and display the page. Now that we understand how DNS works, let's talk about the different types of DNS records that make the system function. 1. A record, address record, maps a domain name to an IPv4 address. This is the most common DNS record. 2. AAAA record, IPv6 address record, similar to an A record but maps to an IPv6 address. 3. Point C name canonical name record, allows one domain to alias to another. For example, www.example.com can alias to example.com. 5th MX record, mail exchange record, directs email messages to the correct mail servers. For example, Gmail's MX records route emails to their servers. 6th NS record, name server record, specifies which DNS servers are authoritative for a domain. 7. TXT record used for various purposes, including security features like SPF, Sender Policy Framework, for email. These records ensure that DNS not only maps domain names to IP addresses, but also helps with mail routing, server information, and additional verification processes. DNS caching plays a significant role in improving the speed of the Internet. When a DNS query is made, the DNS resolver stores the IP address for a certain period of time to avoid having to resolve the domain again on subsequent visits. This caching improves performance, reduces traffic on DNS servers, and speeds up the browsing experience for users. However, the cache has an expiration time known as time to live, TTL. Low TTL means changes to DNS records propagate quickly, but it can cause more DNS lookups. High TTL means fewer queries to DNS servers, but can delay changes to records. A typical TTL might range from a few seconds to a few days, depending on how frequently a website's DNS records are updated. Now that we've explored how DNS works, let's take a look at some common issues users and network administrators face. DNS propagation delay. After updating DNS records, it can take time for changes to propagate across the Internet. This can lead to delays or access issues. DNS spoofing, cache poisoning. Attackers can tamper with a DNS resolver's cache, redirecting users to malicious websites. DNS server downtime. If your DNS provider's server is down, you won't be able to access websites. DNS resolution failures. Incorrect configurations or missing records can prevent DNS resolution, making websites unreachable. 
understanding these issues is key to maintaining a healthy and secure DNS infrastructure. Given the importance of DNS, security is crucial. One way to secure DNS is through DNS SEC, Domain Name System Security Extensions. DNS SEC helps prevent attackers from tampering with DNS records by digitally signing them. When a DNS resolver receives a DNS SEC signed response, it can verify that the record hasn't been altered in transit, but DNSSEC isn't the only security feature. Let's look at other measures. DNS over HTTPS, DOH, encrypts DNS queries between the client and the resolver, preventing eavesdropping and man-in-the-middle attacks. DNS over TLS, DOT, similar to DOH but uses TLS encryption. These technologies help protect the integrity of DNS queries and maintain privacy. Let's dive into some advanced DNS concepts that make the internet more resilient and responsive. Anycast. This technique allows multiple servers around the world to share the same IP address. DNS queries are directed to the nearest server, improving speed and redundancy. DNS load balancing. DNS can be used to distribute traffic across multiple servers. For instance, multiple IP addresses can be associated with a single domain name, and the DNS resolver can return a different IP address based on load or health. Geolocation-based DNS. Some DNS systems can return different IP addresses based on the user's geographic location, ensuring faster content delivery by directing them to the nearest data center. These advanced techniques help websites remain fast, reliable, and highly available. Let's look at how DNS is managed in the real world using some of the most popular tools available today. cPanel, a web hosting control panel that makes managing DNS records simple for website owners. Cloudflare, a popular DNS and CDN provider that offers high performance and enhanced security. Amazon Route 53. AWS's DNS service that provides scalable and highly available DNS management for cloud resources. These platforms make DNS management easier for users without the need for deep technical knowledge. DNS is at the heart of the modern internet, and understanding how it works is crucial for both users and IT professionals. From resolving simple website names to implementing advanced security measures, DNS ensures that the internet remains fast, secure, and reliable. We've covered the basics of DNS, how it works, its common issues, security, and practical DNS management. Thanks for watching and see you next time.